Good evening and welcome back. If you watched the last video, you would have seen our first match in Europe in the Europa League with a 1-0 win against RB Leipzig. Now we've got the biggest match of our season so far at home to Real Madrid in La Liga. Now we did beat them last time in Copa del Rey in our first season in the quarterfinal, I believe it was. Very tough match. It was the toughest match I had faced up until that point. Let's jump into the team lineups. Wow, and just looking into the team lineups, you can see we've been hit hard by some downward form. The likes of Fabio Vieira, Arcas, and Xerxy, who were all rested ahead of this game to try and start. They can't play. So, what we're going with? We're going with Schubert and Goal. Baka, Omaragic, Kosinu and Emerson, the back four, that's our full strength. We're going to put Alex Mariba in, in defensive midfield. We'll actually change that to centre midfield, but he's going to be the deepest lying uh, midfielder. Cousins and Harrington as the uh, more attacking midfielders. We're going to go with Castro up front with Mudrik and Perez playing on the wings. So by no means is this a full strength lineup, but with the strength and depth we've got in our squad now, well, hopefully we'll have enough. Playing in our second choice kit at home, and Real Madrid playing in their usual pristine white. Um, just felt like playing in those strips. This is probably my favorite strip, this red, reddish pink uh, color, really like it. But anyway, let's, oh, it's not a good start. You know, they are very strong in midfield and we've lost a little bit there with Vieira not playing. Xerxes up top as well, that's a big miss. Oh, thought that was in. Hit the stanchion behind the goal. Lovely turn from Benzema. I mean, Castro, when he's played, he's done really well, but he is a different type of player than... Um, Xerxes, and I think we really needed that today, that hold-up that Xerxes offers. And that's poor for Mariba. Just absolutely clearing it there. Is it offside? Maybe they give a free kick away. Yeah. Scrappy so far. Can't keep the ball at the moment. Good tackle from Harrington there. Couldn't quite get Mudrick through. And oh, he was unlucky there. Although the Real Madrid player was lucky. Lots of space on this right hand side. Good tackle. Nice play there from Cousin. Snamari both charging forward. Mudrick, Castro, oh, just hit the defender, didn't think he knew much about it. And again. Can't quite find a way through the defence. Emerson getting back though. He is quick. He's definitely the more attacking of our fullbacks. He's got to be careful. He does offer a lot of support going forward though. We've seen that in the first few games that he's played. Feels like we're going to have to be a little bit patient in this game. 
wouldn't say patience is always a, a strength of, of mine in this game. Nice play there. First shot on goal. Fairly straightforward for Courtois, but playing a little bit better. Again, we're not winning those physical battles, but we've got a chance here. Castro, ah, oh, the right thing to do there, playing Carlos Perez in, but couldn't uh, quite get it through. Now here's Mudrick. Now Cousins. Get a little bit lucky there. Here's Perez. Now Emerson. Cousins was slightly overrun. Back at, like I say, he seems to be more, the more so solid defensively. The Wimax. Here's Emerson. Oh, couldn't get it through. There were so many white shirts in there. Ah, it's not free kick. I got the ball there. Not the most entertaining of their first halves, but things are starting to pick up a little bit in the last 10 or 15 minutes. Here's Emerson charging forward. Perez. Now Castro, can he find some space? He can. Here's Mudrick. And again, it just hits a defender. And it's nil-nil, but we're the better of the team towards the end of that first half there. Just looking at the stats, well, the majority of possession, but only one shot on target. It's tough, but it does seem like the you know the really high-end quality teams get that. It's not luck, but the ball is almost like a magnet to players. You know they block the ball, their shots and passes. Um, it's just something you have to deal with, just the way it is. Trying to pressure them here. And we do we'll pressure them into a mistake. Here's Perez, Mariba, Harrington. Never going to get that shot through. Like I say, they always block them. Right. Chance at a corner here. Now we have been trying to work on this a little bit. And Cousins is good at uh, free kicks and corners. Not bad. Here's Harrington. Mudrick. Perez. 1-0. And I would say that's just about deserved. We haven't created many chances at all. That's all, the only... Sh the, sorry, that's only the second shot that we've had. But we're patient. We've had to be... How it done? Fire the ball into Mudrick. Simple ball into Perez. And he's not going to miss that. Just get that pass through there ahead of Tony Cruz. Now Real Madrid, who have not been attacking really, they're going to have to do something that could free up a little bit of space. Every time we seem to get the ball forward, they've got a number of players uh, defending, which has been the problem. A wall of white shirts. Hopefully that's going to open up now. Emerson's played well. He's offered a lot, a lot going forward on that right. Rebet into Mudrick. That's not at all clearly where I was trying to play it. Benzema had a bit of space there. Oh, 
Good save. I probably defended as best I could at you know, crowd him out a little bit. He still got the shot away. Good tackle there. Oh, come on. That's not a free kick. A yellow card as well. Don't understand that. Just clearing it there. Good tackle again. And Cousins is through here. It's not the quickest and there's not really any support. Oof, just about blocked there. And how it done on the overlap. And how do they get in the way of that? The, again, the AI get very lucky. What's that? Well, given a free kick way back when, going to make some subs here. So we're going to bring on Bajer for Hamilton in that attack midfield role and we are going to bring on Teixeira for Baka just because he's on a yellow and he nearly got a second yellow there. Didn't really have much choices in terms of subs. People are either tired or not on form. I'm not bringing on someone with a, a red downward arrow. It's just no point of playing someone like that. Especially against a team like Real Madrid. Oof. That, uh, that could have went anywhere. Nice play by Mariba. Now Cousins. Mudrick. Castro. Don't know how. Yeah. Should learn no better. Oh, it's a poor ball. I was actually aiming for Bajer, not Emerson. Good interception there. And again, they get lucky. Take one for the team there, but the play on. Now Castro, has he got any support? Again, they get lucky. Castro into Bajer. Castro again. Mudrick, that's nowhere near Mudrick. Don't know what was going on there. <laughs> Marie Bet. Jet. Oh, nicely played. Straight at the keeper. Anywhere to the left or right, and that probably would have been in. Good tackle from Emerson there. And of course, Perez. Mariba to Bajer. Castro. Great ball through. Oh, great save. Take share and mops up, though. Beautiful ball. Oh, well defended. Good tackle. The lump is forward, but they're not getting it there. Nice play. Well, that was a brutal challenge, wasn't it? And there it is, full time. Only the one goal in it, but um, I think we were well deserved winners in the end. We had the majority of the possessions, five shots with five being on target. They didn't really create too many threats. They looked like they could be dangerous on the counter-attack, but they never quite pulled it together. Schubert had that one save that he made, um, but that was about it, really. Carlos Perez being man of the match. With the goal, I'm not really surprised. He did offer a threat. I thought Castro was pretty good. Cousin and Mariba were pretty solid.
And as you can see, we're still top of the table just by goal difference, but we're only one of three teams that have won all the games so far. Next match, we're away to Celta to Vigo. Hopefully you can join me for that one. Hit that like button, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date. But I'll see you all next time. Cheers.